got our small trailer backed up to the pig pen. We've got an animal crate in here. And we've got a ramp. So we're gonna take down this and get those guys loaded up. We're gonna pull it around to our driveway where we have somebody meeting us to get the two boars. So this has worked out really good. This is the same guy that bought our other um, offspring. He needed some boars and we worked out a good deal. We are bartering and working out a good deal for him and it works out good for us. So he does bees. So he'll be getting us some bees in the spring and he'll be getting some boars and we'll be getting that space to be able to utilize it for the mama pig and her babies. What do you guys think of that? They're like, how come you haven't fed us? Everybody else has been fed. We're sitting here waiting. I know, baby. Yeah. We're waiting to feed you to get you to load up into the trailer. We're tricking you. We have been free ranging the ducks and the chickens have joined the free ranging as well. So we keep the cooney cooney in here. Bowser still gets in and out on his own little door. He still fits, but the buck and lashes stay out here. Lashes isn't supposed to be in here, but she's a difficult beast. So we're keeping her in here to keep her safe. <laughs> They're eating the duck food. The ducks sharing with them. It's working out pretty well. I like this little menagerie. That's a chunk of frozen eggplant and squash that was freezer burnt. So it'll be defrosted by morning and they'll have it for breakfast, I guess. Bowser's like, I can eat it. I do wonder if the pigs would try to eat the poultry, but only the ducks come into this section. The chickens don't. So I guess the ducks are big enough to defend themselves. And this beautiful babe seems like she is on a heat cycle now. So that's good news. We can at least tell what her heat cycle is. And it is regular. She, I didn't notice the one three weeks ago but it was six weeks ago when I know she was in heat, when I thought she was in labor, and she is back in heat now. So I'm pretty sure she's got a good cycle going. I'm gonna take a closer look and set my calendar to alert me so that I can see the symptoms at the six week, at the three week mark, sorry. All right, let's see how this goes. We got a trail of breadcrumbs. Bread is the way to a pig's heart. We're hoping that we can just take the fence down and they're gonna follow the trail that we laid out. But who knows? This is, this is I think, better done with patience than with force. So that's the route we're gonna try first.
you tell me when to... We gotta get the bodies at least halfway in, don't we? Can you throw some of those that are stuck? I'm trying to get to that end of the cage more so. We've got one that's shoulders in. we got shoulders. I can't, I'm not strong enough to push them, I just learned. Even with a board to protect me from being tossed, I... There you go. Put that up more if you need it. We're running out, so I might want to go slower. They're going to eat their way in. Slowly, slowly. When they find out that that's grain right in that corner, I think that's going to be the clincher. I am so scared to try doing it before they're all the way in. Oh, yeah. But they're long. I did it. We did it. <laughs> With a few tortillas to spare. Save that for the cattle trailer. That might be as easy or as hard as this. Who knows? <laughs> They don't even care. They got food. Oops. Caught the wheel well on the gate post. Good thing we put those in solid. They started testing the bottom of the cage, so I'm riding to hold these boards in place. What you do to sell a pig? I do anything. I do anything to try to improve things here on the farm. I close my gates to where they have to. Yep. I do this on the side of the road with I don't know how you do that. Back each other's Yeah, I think transferring them is going to be way easier than getting them on in the first place. There. Uh oh. Just do what you want. Yeah, they're pretty tame once they're out. It's the getting them to go where you want. Well, they still locked up. All right, we did it, we did it. And I haven't made dinner yet, so I need to go in and make these kids some food because they're hungry. Thank goodness they were behaving so that I could get this job done. One more thing off my to-do list for tonight. <laughs>